Hello everyone. Are you wondering whether to come to hospital when your child is having some breathing difficulties? Do you have any questions about it? Yes, of course you do. Let's now try to answer some of those questions. You have a child who has a breathing difficulty. What do we mean by that? The child has fast breathing, has noisy breathing, has recessions or indrawing of the chest wall or the muscles of the chest wall or his grunting. Is it a good time to visit a doctor? Yes, absolutely. In this video, let's just talk about some of the red flag signs for presenting immediately to a emergency room or a clinic to get the child checked out with breathing difficulty. Now the child who is breathing fast and especially breathing fast when calm, not having a fever or at rest or in sleep is a red flag sign. This indicates that there is some amount of difficulty in breathing. There is something happening which is preventing the child from taking normal breaths. When the child has persistent fever or a persistent cough in the preceding few days and then presents with breathing difficulty, it could indicate a pneumonia or a viral infections in young children such as viral bronchiolitis. This is another point for the child to be checked out immediately. When the breathing difficulty is of a sudden nature, acute onset, that is another pointer towards a serious underlying issue and may require presentation to the emergency uh, immediately. When a child who is otherwise well, is active, playful, cheerful, suddenly becomes listless and lethargic, loses interest in play, in feeding, and shows signs of breathing difficulty, this could point to an underlying disorder causing uh, breathing difficulty such as pneumonias. This is another red flag sign for one to present to the emergency room. When a child has a background, say for example, a child is born preterm and a few months later has breathing difficulty, this could be another possibility uh, where the child needs to be checked out immediately. One of the other conditions which requires immediate attention is choking on a foreign body. You may notice that the child is otherwise playful, was playing, eating, and within half an hour or one hour develops respiratory distress or breathing difficulty which is very sudden and also you notice that the child was choking some time back. This could point that the child could have a choked on a foreign body which is causing breathing difficulty. So this is another important condition where one must get the child checked out. I hope I have answered some of your questions as to when to present to the pediatric emergency when a child is having breathing difficulty. At Astro Whitefield, we have a 24-7 pediatric emergency which is well equipped to triage, assess and treat these conditions, particularly children with breathing difficulties. Please present with your child if you have any doubts with regards to the breathing difficulty, what is the cause, what is the nature, is it serious or otherwise. We will treat you well.